This is from the magazine Speak Up. This comes, you can buy this at Sanborn for my 50 pesos. It has a magazine and a CD. This is an article on Dr. House. Hugh Laurie stars as Dr. Gregory House in the successful U.S. series, House. Each episode focuses on a patient who's dying from a rare disease. Dr. House and his team of experts must discover the cause and find a solution. He's arrogant and cruel. He's grumpy, middle-aged man who is crippled and walks with the aid of a walking stick. This is not the recipe for a successful American TV show. So why is House a worldwide success? It's the eccentricity and genius of Dr. House, a man who's ready to risk his career for his patients. He refuses to accept the obvious, ignores orders to stop investigation, and eventually reveals the truth. Executive producer Paul Antanasio, inspired by the New York Times diagnosis column, wanted to create a medical version of the American hit series CSI. The show's principal writer, David Shore, decided, however, to focus on the characters of the medical team. House, an infectious disease specialist, bullies and argues with his group of young colleagues, especially Dr. Eric Foreman, who regularly questions House's ability. House also ignores hospital administrator Dr. Lee C. Cuddy's frequent reprimand. He has just one friend who he, is, who he confides in, Dr. James Wilson. The creator of the series, Dr. David Shore, modeled the doctor's character on Sherlock Holmes. Even the name House is synonymous of Holmes. Both men have supreme deductive power and are addicted to drugs and play musical instruments. Arthur Conan Doyle, in fact, based the character of Holmes on the famous medical diagnostician, Joseph Bell. Hugh Laurie won the starring role in the hit series when producer Brian Singer saw his audition. This is what the show needs, he declared, a real American actor. Hugh Laurie, an Englishman who does an excellent American accent, is in Paris, but he feels guilty because he now earns far more than his father, a real doctor. Now, we have these words in blue. I'm going back up here. And these words in blue uh, are definitions of the English word in Spanish. So we'll go to dry. Here's the word dry. I won't pronounce the Spanish, but you can see it and read it. No time to waste. Deceive. Grumpy. Crippled. With the aid of a walking stick. Infectious disease specialist. Bullies and argues. Questions. Addicted to drugs. Guilty. Earned. 
This completes our lesson. Thank you very much for your attention.